say, I don't know what's going on with you, but you smell good now. <laughs> you know my smell is my thing. <laughs> hey, I'd like to say to you, uh -oh. um... What? I'm so happy that everything worked out with Billy. Oh, and thank I'm you so very sorry. much. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. As my father likes to say, I, I prayed to the God I don't believe in. <laughs> and I'm so glad everything worked out. And congratulations. Thank you very Two much. Two kids, four kids. Yeah. Two since us. Yeah. Uh, so I guess it really is over. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I figured that was the best way I get to it. tell you. No, I'm happy for you. <laughs> How are you doing? Well, you, by the way, you were you had a health scare, a real, like a really serious health scare, not long ago. What tell? Well, tell us what happened because I know this is in your special, but take our audience here through that. Uh, uh let was me try to nutshell real, it. Was it a real? It's serious thing. It's crazy that I'm alive. Okay. I went to the doctor with a sore throat. Who goes to the doctor for a sore throat? You. But I did. You, yeah. Right. <laughs> and uh, he said, this is life or death. We're going to the emergency room. I had an um, abscess at the top of my windpipe that was either going to grow another millimeter and choke me to death or explode and kill me that way. And so... Why would it kill you if it exploded? Because it's filled with poison. Oh, really? Yes. Wow. And uh, really, my manager, Amy, could tell you everything because the whole thing is a fog to me. But um, they had to put me in like a semi-coma. I couldn't be put to sleep all the way, which sucks because now all these like memories are floating back. But my, you know, my blood pressure is very low, so they couldn't right. put me totally out. So they just gave me like all the heroin in the world, basically. <laughs> and I had a breathing tube for a week. And whenever I would wake up, they had to tie my hands down, Jimmy, because you know, human nature, when you feel something down your throat, is to pull it out. So I would wake up, I'd feel this thing down my throat, and I'd go to pull it out, and then I'd realize my hands were tied down, and then I just assumed what anyone would assume, which is I have been captured by ISIS. <laughs> truly, truly, right? <laughs> Oh my God, I should close with this. So, um, then a sister would have to say, not a nun, but one of my sisters. Okay, yeah. But either way, it would work. Uh, you know, sweetie, you're okay, you had a thing, blah, 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 blah. And then I would go, oh, and I'd fall back to sleep. And then 30 seconds later, I wouldn't remember any of it, and the whole thing would happen again. But, um. Wow, that's very scary. And your whole family converged there and everything? You, uh, my, my sister told my parents not to come. <laughs> we just. <laughs> You know it's probably for the best. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. That would not have been helpful. But you did, I guess, is, is this uh, something? Wait! OK, I'm not going to show it. Wait for it! I do want to add. <laughs> we always have this problem. <laughs> Can I just? <laughs> um, I'm not going to, I won't show it yet. Can I just say, because I have, there's one. There are a couple funny stories that I had to hear about after. Oh, are okay. you someone going like this or something? No. Okay. No. I mean, there's one Hi. crazy guy just doing it, but it has nothing to do with the show. <laughs> um, they would give me a pencil and paper, and I would I would try to write things down to communicate. So a nurse came in, and somehow I communicated like I have something very important to tell you or ask you or something. So she's waiting, and I'm writing, writing down. And I don't remember this at all, but apparently I just wrote, do you live with your mother? And then a picture of a <laughs> Now, let me just say because I know that this is, I know that this is on ABC. This is probably blurred out because yeah, yeah. of so much But <laughs> if I say, is this a or is this a finger. Is this asparagus? It is asparagus. Unblur it. It's asparagus. <laughs> and how did she react to this uh, question? I just looked at my hair and it doesn't look, look how I imagined. Don't look at your hair. Imagined. I've told you that a million times. Okay. All right. Well, but you came through it and is there any danger now that it will recur? <sighs> no. No. Okay, good. Well, that's good But news. I did like having you worried a little bit. <laughs> well, I was worried. I mean, it's very unlikely it would recur. It, OK. And your boyfriend, Michael Sheen, how is he doing? Was he there by your side? He was there by my side the whole time. He, like, he would shoot Masters of Sex and then just sleep in a chair next to me. 
Don't remember any of it, though. <laughs> Didn't really... Are you sure that happened? Is there any photographic Probably evidence not. that it happened? <laughs> he is my on-again, off-again lover. Oh, and... is he on-again, off-again? Well, I mean... I didn't know about the off again. No, he's on again. He's, I call him my on again, off again lover because we were, uh, you know, apart by oceans. One well, ocean. He doesn't I'm live here? Really sure. His daughter turned 18. He wanted to go home. Well, aren't you supposed to go home? Oh, his daughter turned 18 here and he went yes, home. Yes, he's I here see. to be with his, you know, near his daughter. Now she's off. She's going to start her own life. She's going to NYU. And he really has a calling to, you know how I'm like kind of politically active. He wants to be, and he needs to be home to do that. So he's there a lot. And then we just long for each other and we see each other and we love each other. But you don't really, you don't live in the same, on the same continent. I mean, we visit. Oh, okay. All right. Yeah, this, I don't know. I... <laughs> you know me, I'm a loner, so it, it's okay, <laughs> but yeah. I... All right, well, we'll figure it all out. I don't, you, you, you have a dog, right? <laughs> I have a dog. <laughs> Sarah Silver is here. She has a dog, so don't worry about her, all right? Do you love clicking buttons and subscribing to things? Then click the button to subscribe to my channel, and you'll finally be happy.